now we're going to have to complete the code of DRS, make DRS. So this uh, for this method is used to make the directory. So for that purpose, I'm going to create file, file, sorry, temp dir is equal to new file, temp dir will be stored. Now, what does it really mean? It means that uh, we are actually getting the path of that temporary directory which we have defined in the previous uh, videos. Now, if temp dir dot exist, then do this. If temp dir dot is directory, then do this. So we have now this method. But if temp directory, which is actually referencing or holding this temp dir, which we have previously declared in the previous videos, then create a directory that is temp dir.mkdirs that means that create a directory in that path and if it is not then we're going to have to change something in that case and first of all I'm going to have to save it now I'm going to have to create a list of files that are going to check it out that whether the temp directory existed or not or whether it is deleted or not so I'm just going to create a file array that are going to be holding files and in this files, I'm going to check it out each and every uh, temp directory there, whether it is present or not. So I'm going to use uh, tempdir dot list files. So it's going to list the files, whatever the files are present or not, and then I'm going to check it out. For that purpose, I'm going to loop through each file. So for loop, and uh, I'm going to use like uh, file file, and that is files. So I, I am now looping through each and every file. I'm going to check it out that if file.delete, then do the following code. But uh, it is actually, uh, actually one of the most important thing in this that uh, whether it is deleted or not. So now the, it is error giving me error that uh, I don't know what kind of error is this, but uh, it may be because of this for loop. I have just tried the wrong syntax, so it will be now the query syntax, and now we are able to do some changes in it. And now, if we are failed to delete the file, then we're going to have to just system.out.println failed to delete the file. And that is now we are ended with this section of making directories only one thing we're going to have to just return is temp yeah that is directory we are actually returning it back to the directory where we are using it in here in this mac directory so if this directory exists then we are giving it in here in this section now we have almost completed the draw it class the draw it class we have now almost completed it and all the necessary codings we have done in this class now we're going to move on to the next class this is actually an anonymous inner class which is actually dealing with the canvas activities and we're going to be now using the pan methods and all these methods in this class and uh, and now we will be dealing with this draw canvas uh, class in the in the upcoming videos.